The dirt mile has an extremely short run to the first turn. Post position will be important. Blue Chipper is a Kentucky bred that has earned just under a million bucks in Korea. The only figure we have makes him borderline competitive and may not even be accurate. Sadly, we don't have any studies for Korean shippers or the trainer to show you. Cold Front has run negative numbers in the past, but tailed off after the one he ran in Dubai. You could make the case he's cycling around again, but A, the time to try to catch unsound horses early in their campaigns, and B, such as record in dirt breeders' cup races in California is abysmal, with about two-thirds running X's, and the sample is not small. Diamond Oops is another with soundness issues, as indicated by all the white space on the sheet. This guy worked his way down to a top at Saratoga that represents a lot of development. After a couple of months off, he came back going long on turf and ran okay. If he can run to his top now, he could get a piece of this. But he's only run that fast once, and it's hard to rely on. Giant Expectations ran negative figures two years ago, but wasn't as good last year or this until his last at Del Mar. If he can repeat that race again, it would probably be good enough here. The negatives here are that he's never put races that good back to back and his history of wide trips. The positives are he's locally based, has been giving 10 weeks to recover, and with a limited sample, Erton has done okay at this. Improbable ran a good one in April, but has never gotten back to it, which is not a good sign. We will watch how Baffert's earlier runners do, but our initial view is not positive. Omaha Beach is trained by Mandela, who has a history of getting big efforts, which then set the horse back. We think that's what happened with Omaha Beach this spring, and we were looking to bet against him in the Derby, but he didn't make it there, which we don't think is a coincidence. After six months off, he came back and matched that top effort. It is possible Omaha Beach won't react this time, but big efforts following a layoff often cause a bounce the next time out for many trainers. So we don't want to find out a short price, especially with Mandela's trainer pattern. He usually gets that big effort on the big day, but he got a one race too early this spring and might have done so again now. Spun to run and the other three-year-olds are similar. They have tops around zero, probably a little too slow, and are shipping east-west and coming in late to the party. By this time, we should have a good idea as to whether the rail is okay. If it is, Giant Expectations is a clear play. He might fire and he might not, but if he saves ground, he can get into the exotics, even going back a couple of points.